Welcome to another video tutorial. In this video, I will show how we can design primer for QPCR or real-time PCR. What we need to do, we need to simply write ITTDNA. This is a famous company. So what we need, we need to find one tool of this company. And uh, yeah, the first link is here. You can just simply click on this. After clicking uh, this website uh, will uh, the website main page will come you can go to main tools and uh, here is real time PCR tool you can simply click on real time PCR tool so uh, this is the website where we can design the primers for our real time qPCR say so uh, we can use two ways the first we can simply uh, enter the accession number or we can uh, simply paste the sequence of cds so let's take one example of cds so this is the rice database let me enter the id for one gene Yeah, let's suppose this is one gene and uh, we want to get its, its uh, CDS sequence. We can simply click on this. Yeah, and here we can see its download sequence. So uh, here we can see that this is the CDS sequence. We can simply uh, copy the CDS sequence and paste here yeah we should make sure that if uh, this sequence is not in the capital letter sometime uh, maybe you are using different databases where this sequence is not in the capital letter like uh, suppose your sequence is like in in the small letters so you should must aware that this letter all should be the like here this is the lowercase if all these letters are in lowercase then you should must change it to uppercase uh, because this website only takes uppercase as exon so uh, because our gene is already in the uppercase you just need to click on design assays it will just take few seconds yeah we can see that the task is being completed yeah here we can see that we are uh, designing primer from exons because cds is exons nick region so we can click on because uh yeah uh, the position is from this and here is the amplicon size and optimum uh, so we just don't need to change anything we can simply click on design assays and move to next so it is now processing the request yeah, we can see that real-time QPCR RSA entry. Yeah, please wait. Your request is being processed. Yeah, it may take a few minutes. If your sequence is especially big, it will take just a few more seconds to upload. Yeah, we can see that now our QPCR primers are ready. So uh, I want to tell you that this company is very reliable and even I have tried by myself that these primers have really high efficiency for annealing and uh, you can get your gene expression. You can simply just copy from here and uh, send to your company and design your primer. If you have any question related to the real-time QPCR, please tell me in the comments. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.